Hey everybody, welcome back. This is Mr. Cleaver. Um, I'm just gonna cut right to it. This sucks. Uh, I, 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 man, I miss you guys. It, I'm super excited to be back in my classroom, but not like this. Not with the empty chairs. Not with the the, the lack of voices and noise. And man, I can't tell you how much uh, I'm excited to start working with you guys again but also bummed that it has to be like this. And that's all I'm gonna say, just gonna address that once, get it out of the way, and just, you know, became a teacher to work with you guys live in person, not to make videos and, and send emails. But with that being said, I'm here in front of last year's origami wall. If you were with me beginning of last year, we did origami to introduce ourselves. And this is, this was awesome. Um, we got something a little different we're gonna do this year. But so what I wanna just stay, say here at the beginning is welcome back. Um, I look forward to talking to you. I look forward to texting back and forth with you through through uh, the classroom. Uh, I look forward to working, and I look forward, most importantly, to discovering hopefully a different way to to teach English and interact with you guys. The sound of the bell. The bell still makes me feel like I'm oh, I'm gonna start class. But I'm looking forward to maybe learning some new ways to interact with you guys and help you guys learn how how reading and writing and critical thinking can benefit you in life. It's not just about literature and essays, but it's about communicating and having a voice and making your position clear and really being able to use language to d defend yourself, stand up for yourself and promote yourself. And that's really what I want to focus on this year. So what we're going to do here to start, super simple. I want you to kind of just poke around this classroom. This classroom's a little different. If you're seeing this, you're already in here, which is good. This is Canvas. I used it a little bit last year in Digital Media Productions. I've spent the summer figuring out how to actually use it correctly. And so there's a lot of tools in here that will help us do a little bit more than we could with Google Classroom. Um, you're also going to find the schedule. If you click on that schedule link, if you haven't already seen it, Monday and Wednesday, periods one, two, and three, we're together for an hour. And then uh, Tuesday, Thursday, periods four and five, we're together for an hour. And that's going to be some live time together. So you're going to see that there's going to be things for you to do on your own and things for you to do live in class. Now, my goal is to get us to collaborating and thinking critically and communicating and being creative, not bury you with work. That's not my goal. Um, but if you've been in my class before, you're going to see that the whole class flow is going to change quite a bit this year. Uh, I spent a lot of time working with the staff here during the summer and with some other professionals. We're really trying to figure out how to do this a little different. Um, you guys know the expectations. Uh, you know, my expectations haven't changed. Learn and earn. That's all I really want you to do. I want you to earn credits. I don't want to make that a difficult process for you, but I want you to learn something useful along the way. And we're going to figure this out together. This is on a trial basis. Everything we're doing is on a trial basis. Some things are going to work. Some things aren't. So your feedback, what you need, what you want, I, I encourage that. I can't promise you I'm going to be able to adjust to all of your needs. But if I see things corporately that, that aren't working, we're going to move away from those. And if I see things that are, we're going to move towards those. So I want you to know that this is something that we're going to build together. So do me a favor and go ahead in the, uh, in the assignment here. You can click on, on text submission or you can click on video submission. And, and just let me know how you're doing, how, how uh, everything is. Check in, say hi. Um, doesn't have to be anything academic. I just want to hear your voice. If you're new, nice to meet you. I'd love if you did the, the video submission so I could kind of see your face. And with the video submission, I'm the only person that sees it and hears it. No one else does. Um, it just, it, it's a way to kind of connect like this. And I'm a visual person. I need faces to go with names. It helps me a lot. So if you could do the video submission, just say hello and let me know like what grade you're in and or how many credits you need or, you know, what's your favorite sport or, you know, anything that you want to say hi and check in with. I would love to get to know you that way or start to get to know you that way. And as we're going to do the first couple of weeks, we're going to work on getting to know each other and navigating this platform. Um, it's going to be pretty easy to start out and then we'll ramp into the more English stuff. Uh, I've rambled on too much. I miss you guys. I look forward to doing some cool stuff together. I just look forward to connecting again. Man, I, yeah, I really do miss you guys. You guys are such a huge part of me and Mrs. Cleaver's life. You don't even know. You guys are like our kids and we love you. So check in and then we'll get going. Mr. Cleaver, out.